Alright guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, in this video, I'm going to share with you one of the copywriting topics. And before I do that, let me show you a little trick by bringing a friend of mine called Mr. Pinky and he will say hello to everyone. Mr. Pinky, please say hello. Hi. Okay, back to the topic again. Uh, I'm going to share with you one of the um, strategy that I always use called the rule of one strategy. It is so popular and effective and it was invented by the famous American marketer called Michael Masterson. Okay, why is it so effective? Because it helps you to stay focused on only one thing whenever you write a copy. And of course, there are many versions of it. I've come up with the seven steps in this rule of one strategy. And let's say if you're interested to find out more how this rule of one strategy can benefit you to write better copy that can shoot through the roof, please remember to stay till the end of the video. The first step of the rule of one strategy is to focus on only one target audience. Why? Because let's say if you are writing a copy that focuses on everyone, you are basically targeting no one at all. Well, you can create a customer personas uh, to understand what are their greatest pain points and desires by focusing on this one target audience so that they will resonate with your product offer and uh, feel more confident to buy from you. To write a successful copy that resonates with your audience, you need to emphasize on this one big core idea which is the second step of the rule of one strategy. Why is it important? Because firstly, it provides clarity to your readers of what will they be benefiting if they want to purchase the product offer from you. Second is to remove any objection in their mind to find out whether your product offer is suitable for them. For example, you can say how to make $200 a day using a mobile phone. The big core idea in this headline is how to make $200 a day. So by having this one big core idea, it definitely provides clarity and attract them to find out more about your product offer. Now, the third step of the rule of one strategy that I want to talk about is triggers only one core emotion. Why? Because as human beings, we are all emotional in nature. By having this one core emotion in your copy, it helps to trigger your reader's greatest desire of who they want to be. Or maybe after purchasing your product, will they make their life easier? Or what will happen if they do not purchase your product? So this is one of the most effective uh, copywriting strategies that marketers and copywriters will use to persuade their audience to immediately take an action. Have you ever wondered why you're so immersed in a conversation with a close friend of yours? Well, it's because your close friend is telling you a captivating story that you personally feel connected with. And this is the fourth step in the rule of one strategy, is, which is very important. And as human beings, people love to connect with stories. Why? Because it's established the emotional connection with your readers. And to tell a good story, you need to make your readers be the hero in their story so that they can witness their own transformation by using your product or services. And in fact, if you ask me to write a successful copy, you also need to become a good storyteller as well. In copywriting, besides being a good storyteller, it is important to include this fifth step of the rule of one strategy, which is to paint a specific promise. Why is it important? Because when your readers are reading your copy, they are looking for the key benefit that they will gain before they even want to purchase from you. So by stating this, key specific promise in your copy, it allows your readers to feel more assured and confident so that it can clear all their doubts before they uh, want to buy from you. For example, you can say how to lose 7 pounds of weight within one week using this weight loss formula. The key specific promise is how to lose 7 pounds of weight. So try this out. And let me know if you're able to see the difference 
in your response rate. All right, the number six steps in your rule of one strategy that some marketers may miss out is throwing in an irresistible offer. In fact, the offer is the tip of the spear. It is the most critical part in the copy. You may have the most attractive subject line or maybe an emotional story, but if your offer is not irresistible enough to persuade your audience to take an action, it is still useless. And that's why um, in order to write a successful copy, you need to throw in an irresistible offer that it becomes a no-brainer for your readers to take action. There are few ways you can do it. You can put in money back guarantee or throw in some fear of missing out, uh, urgency or limited or exclusive offer uh, so that your readers will quickly take an action and purchase from you directly. After you have applied the six elements using the rule of one strategy in your copy, please do not forget the last element which is the motivate your prospect to take one call to action. Why is it important? Because your prospects may have read your subject line, your body copy and understand what you're offering. But at the end of the copy, if there's no call to action or maybe you put in too many call to action, it will confuse your prospects and your prospect will not know what to do next. So it is very critical to remember to put in one call to action at the end of the copy so that they will know what to proceed on the next steps after reading your copy. Okay guys, this sums up my rule of one strategy to writing a successful copy and I hope that it will be beneficial for you. If you like this video, please remember to subscribe and comment below and let me know what kind of new topics that you are interested with so that I can produce more videos just to benefit you. Well, always remember, you are just one strategy away to writing a successful copy and I'll see you in my next video.